So let's let's mess him up. Let's put a little loft on it. Let's go a little high. Yeah, there you go. And I think I can come in with my sword. Go a little swing crazy on this fool. Get wrecked. There you go. Oh, welcome back, guys. What is going on? Unite the Clans here back in your life with some too crafty Minecraft. And I am excited to be back on the server. It appears it's nighttime. I am not sure if anyone's online. Let's give this a try. Nope. I'm, I'm all by my lonesome this evening. Guys, I'm excited to be back. Uh, last episode, we set off in search of a home. And we found it in the form of this massive island. Absolutely massive. Um, we got a ton of dark oak over here. We got a bunch more over here. I managed to stop the forest fire that was beginning to rage. Uh, which, by the way, confirms that, yes, this is a brand new island created by me sailing this far out from spawn. Um, I love it here. I can't wait to start building. I'm a little intimidated. It's kind of huge. So what I'm thinking is we'll pick small parts of it and slowly transform them. But to do that, we are going to need a starter house. And I think if I don't have them on me, I have most of them on me. Uh, if I don't have all the supplies on me, we can get them real quick, but I think I'm just gonna put a little starter house down here in the middle of this meadow, and, uh, and then we'll have to figure out, you know, like, uh, building with UTC style, what we're gonna do next. Um, so, I have got a really simple house in mind. It'll be big enough for what we need, uh, to get started, and then I'll be able to expand it if I like it. Uh, so what we're gonna do, I think, is, let's see, uh... Okay, so I'll put one there, and then one, two, so what we'll one there. So what I'm going to do, guys, is lay out a footprint for it. Uh, it's going to take me a sec. I'm doing it from memory. I kind of came up with a, a building creative a couple of days ago, and I think I remember how it's supposed to look. So we're going to use some of the dark oak that is plentiful on our little island here, which, by the way, we will need a name for, guys, other than UTC's island, which is pretty self-explanatory and could work uh if you got a name suggestion we've we've had whimsical names for our places in the past i'm not doing this right these need to be one further from center if i remember properly yeah i think they do i think you go here and here yeah that feels better okay and then we're gonna gonna repeat this pattern uh, but, uh, further back in there, but I'm also going to lay down some stone brick, which uh, I don't have any of. Okay, so let's run quickly up to my crafting table. Actually, let's make ourselves a crafting table. We're going to need one down here, right? Uh, I'll do that. Perfect. And I'll replace my bow. All right, so building on the fly, always a challenge, but I'm always inspired to do it. I, uh, I have to say, guys, some of the builds I've been doing lately on the ARC server have I've amped up my confidence for building on the fly. I've done a few building episodes lately and uh, doing them all on camera instead of build and then walk away and show it to you like I often do. Uh, so this is the beginning. Let's go ahead and hop. Actually, I guess I didn't need a crafting table, but we're going to need one eventually. So let's grab this stuff, spread that out over here. And I don't think I'm going to be doing a ton of regular smooth stone, so I'll just grab what I think... I might need for this we can always grab more and so these are gonna be the corners of our house uh, and I am gonna want oh pig can you do me a favor get lost dude uh, so what I, I want to do is have pillars on either side of the house so we're gonna do that and then we're gonna count out I think one two three and we'll do the same thing here and then one two three and then whoops and then we'll do the same thing over here and I think this is going to be the beginnings of our house. So now we repeat the pattern with the dark oak. And by the way, guys, I started a mine so that I could gather the resources I need for this. And I uh, just started, I went to the lowest point I could find, which was down here. And I just started digging into the ground, roughly over there. I'll tell you what I found. Skeleton spawner. So that is where we are building our first big base once this, uh, once this house is, uh, is complete. Once we move on to a bigger, better build, that's what's on the to-do list. It's going to be fun. So, I think one, two, and then one here. And then one, two, was it there? Uh, no, here. That is, yeah, here, I think. Okay. Yeah, that feels right. 
and then we're going to continue uh, doing what we did on the other side. Uh, it's going to be pretty straightforward once uh, you start to see the footprint. Uh, and it'll be able to go up pretty quickly. So dead center is here. And we'll do the same thing. Like a so. Perfect. So I am going to work out laying in a floor. And uh, I'll bring you guys back once I've done that. All right, guys, that's the rough pattern. And I'm going to repeat this pattern in the roof. I went and hid my crafting table there. I don't know if I'll decide to keep it. Could always hide it in the roof. But I think we're going to use some oak in this build as well because I've got a good amount of it. Uh, so I think what we're going to do is stick with the dark oak logs and use the oak planks to complement. We'll see. I'm not sure what I think of it, but we'll keep messing around with it. So that's your floor, right? Now we just have to start laying in uh, the walls. And I have a pattern in mind for windows in this place. Uh, oops, something like that then, I think. And I'll go do the same thing on the other end and we'll see uh, how well this goes. This, I think I'll probably call this video something like simple starter house. It's only simple if you're good at building in Minecraft. And so for me, it's a real challenge. Uh, I think I'm gonna do it like that. Yes, yeah, I like the way this is looking. So that's what we're doing. We'll do one there, one there, one there, one there. And then I'm going to have a door on one end, but I don't think I'm going to need a door on both ends. Oh, you know what? I've messed this up. Yeah. So the wall is supposed to actually, this is supposed to be in the center of the wall. So I have messed it up here. Let's fix it if I can manage. We don't need that iron yet. Uh, so I'll put the dirt there. And then I'll uh, chop this out here. I got some fixing to do, guys. I'll be back. All right, guys. So it is morning. And uh, I was just about to sleep in a bed. And then Dee, who is random obsessor, hopped on. And I was like, hey, oh, there she is. She's coming back. And I was like, hey, you anywhere near a bed? She's like, nope. <laughs> like, oh, God, it's so dangerous here. So she just logged off for a minute so UTC could sleep. Um, but if you guys want to mimic this build in your own world, I wanted to show you my uh, my logic so this one is nothing it's just sort of uh for under the door so what i did what i'm gonna do is hop up like this so that's i think four high and then i'll break this one again because instead of centering the um centering it over this one i'm going to center the edge of it one over and that's gonna uh, make sense when we get those pillars in you will see but uh, if i do this boom and now we need the old dirt trick so do one of these and one of these. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to keep this up. Uh, and I think, guys, this build is going to come together really freaking quick. If I had to if I had to guess, uh, I need to hop down. You can hear the sound of that skelly spawner. Uh, so I have never made a XP farm with a skeleton spawner, but I have done it with a zombie spawner and this was before I was a youtuber before I had a youtuber world when I was just playing all you know for fun all by myself right and so I made the uh, zombie one and it was great oh hi creeper I'm gonna have to f mess him up okay let's get far enough away that I have time to get my bow and we're gonna have to kill this fool uh, bow 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 boom oh I got no arrows yes I do okay so let's let's mess him up Let's put a little loft on it. Let's go a little high. Yeah, there you go. And I think I can come in with my sword. Go a little swing crazy on this fool. Get wrecked. There you go. All right. So now that this is done, you got a rough idea of the frame, and you're going to see... Oh, God. Have I messed that up again? No, I haven't. Okay. So you take your oak, and then instead of centering it over here, which is what I did the first time, you put it on either side of here, and that is going to form your door frame. Uh, which is perfect. So we'll do that, and we'll do that, and same thing on this side. Right? And then this is where it starts getting fun, because we're going to start putting in windows. And I think I only need a door on one end. I'm going to do it on this side. Uh, so let's go a little nuts with the windows. We're going to do that, 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 and that. And then I'm going to do roughly the same thing here, but leave space for a door. And then I think going to keep it up as we go along here. So I can't remember how I did this. I think, yes, I think I do that. 
Yeah, totally. So you come right across the bottom there. Oh, God. Dang grass. All right. And break you. And we'll do the same thing on this side. And then we'll get to start laying in even more windows. Uh, if I can remember what the windows side is supposed to look like. So, yes. Okay. So I can put one there. I think I'll end up taking it out. Because what we're going to do is have a vertical... Yes, I am going to take it out, and I'll do it right now. We're going to have a vertical uh, stone uh, stone brick pillar here, and I have just enough to be able to get it the way I want it. So one, two, three, I think is all I need, and we're going to come in underneath uh, this. Actually, I'll, I'll put one up, and you'll get to see if I can reach that, which I can. One there and one there. Perfect. So if I have stone brick stairs, which I don't, but we can make on the fly, uh, I can make one, one, one pile of them, which gives me enough. Uh, so this is the rough idea of how the exterior is going to look. I'm going to do more of these pillars right here and right here. And in my head, I thought they were taller. Maybe I've messed up the height of the build. Maybe the whole build needed to be taller. Or maybe. Huh. All right. Well, yeah, I may need to raise the roof on this a little bit because that feels too cramped for my liking. Um, yeah, I think I think I must have had it taller. It doesn't look like it in my stupid pictures, but it is what it is. Uh, so we got that in there, and then I'll put them here and here. And then from here, this is where we can start. Yes, I totally had it higher. Okay, cool. So I'll uh, I'll fix that, guys. Let me do some fixing, and uh, I'll come back to you when I've got it the way that I had it in uh, creative. All right, guys. I think I got it looking the way I wanted it to look originally. This was my rough plan for the uh, non-door side. And then for the door side, same thing. But uh, what I'm going to do is throw a couple of... Whoops. That's not what I meant, but we can fix it. Uh, I'll hop up here and hop up here and we'll throw one more glass in there and this thing is starting starting to take shape i hope you guys have been able to follow uh, what i've been doing so that is the shape as it stands right now i think i think it's gonna look good uh, we're obviously not done uh, to get a little further down the track i'm going to kind of get these um let's see if i can get some dark oak on there i'm gonna kind of kind of get these pillars looking the way I want to because once the pillars are in place you guys will have a clear idea of how this bad boy is supposed to look so let's get one more up there yep right so this will this will sort of explain some of the crazy steps I've been going through so far to get it looking exactly the way I want it because uh, the idea was to have some pillars and do I have some more of those stairs yes I do to have some pillars uh, up like that oops <laughs> not like that at all that but upside down okay oh idiot it's like I haven't been playing Minecraft for freaking 10 years there like that there we go and so it's roughly gonna look like that and then I'm gonna put a window pattern in and we're gonna do the same cross shape but I'm gonna raise it up one so that uh, let's see throw this back on the bar throw the gra uh, glass back on the bar uh, give me that bow and so we'll do it so that's the bottom of your your thing and like that and so I'll take the glass and we'll go bink 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 perfect I'm gonna repeat that pattern here over here and then I'm gonna finish up the pillars on this side too all right guys I think I missed a random obsessor saying good night but she is off uh, so I should be able to sleep through this night, and I'll show you what we're looking at. Um, I don't know if you get a good... Yeah, you're starting to get a good look at it. It's starting to take some shape. Uh, let me hit hit the sack, whatever you call it. What is that, the expression? It sounds doesn't sound right. Hit the hay? Something like that. And uh, you get a good, good uh, view of it. So I'm going to do a flat roof on it, and that's going to give us the ability to break this uh, there you go to expand it as we go uh, but what we need to do now is get pillars and a cross beam in on this side so I think I'm gonna have enough dark oak to get all the way across oh yeah for sure 
Perfect. All right. And we'll throw in a few of these. So we'll go one here. You can cheat on the corners. See how I've put uh, wood in there? If you're a little low on stone, whatever. Those are completely hidden, so no one will ever see them. But if you're a perfectionist, you're going to want to go back and fix them. Uh, so there we go. And then let's throw this last bit of glass. And I don't... Oh, yes, I have enough. Okay, life is good. Uh, I was going to use some glass in the ceiling. So I hope I've got enough. How many we got left? Six. All right, yeah, I don't have enough to do what I wanted. But we got more sand, so I'll, I'll get a, a thing cooking. Uh, I'll make a door, which we can make right now. I think we'll go with the dark oak door. That feels like the right bet to me uh, because we got the dark oak as our accent color in here. Oh, you get three. I always forget that. I've been playing Minecraft so long. Some of these, these things, like I forget how they're supposed to work. And do we want the door... I think if, I think we want to place it from in here. Let's see how that looks. No, nope, I don't like it. All right, let's break it and we'll place it uh, from outside. I think we're going to want it looking flush. And I'm going to get rid of that now. Yeah, yep. I may come in and put a spruce door in. I feel like it would blend a little better. That dark oak doors doesn't really match the dark oak planks very well. But we got spruce... If I don't have it on the island, I got saplings for it. So that's the rough shape. Oh, I haven't finished. Okay. So that's the rough shape. And the, the ceiling, what I want to do, I think, is mimic what we did above. Uh, or below, I mean. What is that? A witch? That's, yeah, it's a witch. All right. Well, as long as she's not going to bother us too bad, I want to keep up with what we're, we're doing right now, guys. So let's see if I can get... Nope, that's not what I wanted. All right, let me use dirt and I'll pill her up. Will you shut up? I'm going to have to kill this. God, he's tough, eh? She? It? There you go. Just in time to throw one on me. Perfect. That's only going to be completely annoying. Oh, God. Okay, let's get inside. Stupid witches. All right, guys. Ding dong. The witch is dead. I am recovering uh, with my health. This is roughly what the front of the place looks like. I have shown you the sides. And what I want to do now, uh, let's get some dirt. What I want to do now is repeat this pattern here in the ceiling. So let's one, two, three. Yes. Okay even down further so do that and then comes out two i think yes okay perfect so this is gonna work and i think what i'm gonna do with this flat roof guys it'll give me uh sort of the time and the space in the future to is that right one two three okay perfect uh the time and space to expand uh so let's grab this I'm going to want these, and we'll pillar up again, and we'll just get that one awkward little piece in space, in, in position, uh, which is this one. Okay, and that worked, and we'll do that. Now, I have enough glass to do glass in the middle here, which is a, a neat idea. I was going to do it all around, but I think maybe we'll just go back to the standard oak. We'll leave some glass in the middle. Uh, I... We'll need more oak? No, I won't. I've got tons. Okay, life is good. Uh, so we'll just go in and we'll start filling in gaps. And we'll, I'll uh, complete this roof and I'll come back to you guys. So this is it, guys. This is what the roof looks like. you got a little bit of natural light that can sneak in. And then uh, is there going to be a way down that isn't going to kill me? Ish. Sort of. Uh, and then this is our view from the side. I think I like it. What I'll do is uh, maybe take some leaves and put them in here um, and maybe hide some lighting underneath because I had to put up all these torches to keep the baddies away when I was trying to figure out how to sleep for the night. And this is the interior. It's not massive, but it's big enough to do what you need it to do. So what are we? Seven by five. Room for a crafting table, room for furnaces, room for a bed. And then up top, we're going to have room to expand this build. Um, I think... It's, I don't know how I'd expand it yet, but I mean, the quickest and easiest way would be to do something to the effect of this. 
and then you could uh, sort of do a, an arch frame, uh, like uh, an A-frame to the roof. So you could do something like, like that, another one here, another one here. This is, and I did a lot of this, to be honest, in my single player world, uh, so, which we played in up until the, the week before I joined this server. So I think uh, I'm going to be hesitant to just repeat what I've done in the past. But if you need a way to complete this yourself and you don't like the way the flat roof looks, then this is a great way to do it. You just take one of the, oh, how did I mess that up? That, that will go there. You take one of these, uh, you build roughly this shape, and then you can roof across with it. Now, I don't know if that's what we're going to be doing, but uh, for now, I think I'm happy with it. It's fully enclosed. I'm going to move all my stuff from that little safe spot on the top of that sunflower hill down into the house and I think we're gonna call it an episode this place is looking pretty good as is if you wanted to you could take what I've done here uh, do the same thing on the other side and roof it in and if I were doing that I'd do something like actually I mean this is a pretty quick way I can just show it to you real quick but uh, this is what I would do if I were you uh, and you didn't like the way this looks I hell I may even leave it like this uh, until I decide what I want to do up here, this can work. So I'll do that, do that. Boom. Only going to take so much fall damage in the stupid amplified islands. If I'm taking it already, it's going to be a big problem. Uh, put one there. And then, um, yeah, you know what? Screw it, guys. I ain't done. We'll throw a roof on this. And that's, that's that. I'll have to figure out what material I want to use to roof it in. If I can get my hands on enough spruce, I think that would probably be the ideal um, wood type. But a stone roof might look good on here too because we already have uh, a cobblestone, whatever you call it, uh, smooth stone sort of accent pieces. And how am I still missing so many of these pillar pieces? I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Uh, I'll put you there. Okay. Cool. So that's that's the rough shape of it. Obviously, it's not done, and I haven't put a roof on it yet. If I do, I'm going to want to put a little time uh, into it to figure out what... I'm going to hide that. To figure out what the ideal uh, roof material is. But for now, it's a safe, really simple little starter house. And uh, for now, I think that is going to work perfectly for us, guys. All right, guys. I don't know if I know when to stop. I already recorded an outro. But once I started putting a roof on it, I realized it would probably look way better with a roof. So we might as well just do that. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to have it in the perfect material, but I'll have it figured out pretty shortly. Uh, I'm cooking up a bunch more stone brick, and I'll make stairs out of that. And at the very least, guys, we will, uh, we will throw a quick stone brick roof on here. Now, like I said, I've built this roughly this style probably way too much. So I don't want to keep it up. Uh, I think this will probably be the only build that looks uh, just like this. Can I? No, I can't. All right. Well, let's hop on here. I'll break it down. And if it were, if I, I don't, I'm thinking if I had the glass, I would do up there uh, with some glass. But let's uh, hop into the place for now. Actually, you know what? I got some spruce. I forgot I did. So let's grab... Oh, I already did grab some of it. Okay. So let's quickly make up a spruce door and we'll see how that looks or a pile of spruce doors. I think it's going to look better. This, at least to me, I think this is the best looking standard door in the game. I think that's your best bet. Yep. That's it. Way better. Blends in a whole lot nicer. So let's throw the extra doors of all types in here. Uh, I'll take these, I'll take these, and let's check these furnaces, which I have now hidden uh, securely in the floor. And I'm going to make up, you guys, why don't you let me at it? I'll uh, make up a ton of stone brick, and I'll come back to you, and we'll do a quick roof job on this thing. I am going to inset this sort of upper uh, portion. I'm going to set it back. One, instead of putting it in right there, it's going to give it, oops, a little more depth if we do it this way. Um... I like, I have one more, two more, I mean, oh right, of course I can't do that, I forgot that this thing was above my head, and I'll do the same thing over on this side, and I think this is going to give us a good look, I can always come back in here and add, ooh, 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 I like this idea, okay, I'm going to add 
this might be crazy. This might look dumb. I'm going to take some of this. We'll see if it looks dumb. And I'll put them right here. So I'm basically continuing this line that runs through it. Sometimes inspiration strikes you. I won't be able to tell how good this is going to look until we get a little further away from it. Right? Do that and do that. And then we'll take some of this. We'll throw these on. And I still need to grab a, a lot more stone brick stairs. But we'll throw a real quick roof on this thing. All right, guys, I think I am there. Uh, I understand this has probably turned into a longer episode when I refuse to end it. But uh, I'm liking the way this house is coming together, although that isn't placing just the way I want it. Uh, I think I have what we need. We'll see. Uh, I'm going to get that in, and this side is finished. No, I'm going to be a little bit short, but I've got some more uh, cooking. Uh, so we'll just do this. And the great thing about uh, building this way is not only does it make the ends easier, it makes the peak easier. Figuring out how to peak a roof is always an interesting thing. Do you go with the half slab, the full slab? Uh, there's a hundred ways to do it. Um, but when you do it this way, that sort of big vertical cross beam takes care of itself. Um, you could always take it out and replace that with stone and that would give you a different look, but we're going to get close enough to finishing this thing here. Ooh. Okay. Uh, well, perfect time to go get more. Uh, here, where's my door? <laughs> perfect time to go get more uh, uh, stairs. So we'll take that, we'll take that, and I'll make a little bit more. We're almost there. All right, definitely going to be able to make it now. Uh, yeah, I think I think the the look's coming together. I don't want to spoil it for you, so I'll wait until I'm, I'm done it, and then we'll back up and we'll take a good look, and you can let me know what you think. Am I on to something? Is this a cool build? Uh, if you think so, you got to let me know. Uh, and do you want to see more like this? I'm not sure I do. I want to do some new stuff. Uh, I've done a lot of building of just houses. And I think I want to get into something else, whether it's a castle or castle walls or uh, who knows what. I have an idea for uh, a business. You guys saw the commercial district uh, in town. One thing we picked up in episode zero was, one, there's a commercial district. Two, no one's building in the commercial district. And three, there is a lot of things that the guys on this server don't have, like dark oak or jungle wood. So my business idea, and I mean, it might be too much work, but I'm thinking we need a full-on rare goods emporium. Uh, so that's a future build. This this is it. Like I said, you could do this in stone, like solid stone blocks. If I had any, we'd take a look at it. But I think it looks good like this. And we'll, we'll pillar back down, and we'll back up, and we'll take a look at this thing. And I will do an outro once and for all. Final. Finished. Done. All right. One thing we also haven't looked at is that vertical stripe of stone brick. Are you guys ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? That's it. Okay, it doesn't look great from the sides because the actual, or from the front, because the roof part is hidden. Uh, I actually don't love the way that looks from this angle. It actually looks kind of stupid. But uh, what are you going to do? Let's take a look at how it looks from the sides. Yeah, you know what? I almost need to switch. I almost need to line it in stone and fill the inside. Ugh. This, it looks good from the side. It looks good. It's not done. Uh, it's it's as done as it's going to be. That's fine by me, guys. So we're going to call it here. This has been... Wait, let me get this crap out of the way. And I'll back up and we'll take a good look at it. All right, guys. That is it. My simple starter house. This is, what, really day two of playing on the Two Crafty server. I am brand new and I got nothing. I got no resources. We ain't got nothing here. And we're going to need to get those, and if we're going to do it, we're going to need a place to start. A place where it all begins. And for me, I think this house is going to work as that. But look at the space we have to build with, guys. This ain't nothing. This island is about ten times as big as what you're seeing now. So this is just step one. Thank you so much for checking out this episode. And if you would like to see more, I'm going to be building on this server like crazy. So hit that subscribe button and stay the heck tuned. Thank you for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next episode.